What's up guys, Lucas Morley here, RussianSamba.com, MorleyCoaching.com. This is my partner, Alessandro. Uh, I'm gonna be showing you a move from where uh, either MMA or no gi, no gi where he's trying to do a scissor sweep, or MMA, he's trying to create space for me hitting him, okay? All right, let's get started here. Oh no, you're right. I messed up. A little further back now. It's all messed up. <laughs> we didn't practice this. All right, so here, if it's MMA, I'm, maybe I'm, I'm in here, I'm down, I'm punching him in the head, I'm doing the elbows, and he's trying to create space, and he comes in here, okay, to create that space. Or if it's no gi, you know, we're just sitting here, we're fighting, and he's gonna start going for the scissor sweep, he's controlling my arm, he's creating the space. Guys, this is where I'm gonna go right into it. And not a perfect, it's not beautiful, um, but the first thing I'm doing, I'm control his knee, step my right leg, my hand's already on the ground. I'm gonna bring my butt up, I'm gonna kick this through, and I'm gonna step over. Now, in a perfect world, I'm creating a space, I'm opening hips, leg up, coming through, I can hit step over, and I'm nice and tight here, in a perfect world. But, usually, as I step over, he starts rolling. As he starts rolling, I'm gonna go with him. And if I can, I'm gonna control this leg, if I have, again, the perfect world. And then from here, all I'm doing is gonna come up, boom. You can lose the time and do this, and try to come here, but it can also slip, and he continues the roll, and he's out of it. So that's gonna be up to you. So back again, I'm here, this is on the side. I control his leg to keep rolling, and I'm just gonna put that pressure, look at my knee starts going down, and I'm gonna finish it. Three, two, one. Look at the camera, please. All right, guys, from another angle here, um, same exact thing. I'm either ground and pounding him, or um, he opened the guard to do the scissor sweep, okay? Boom, I'm gonna check his knee, post the hand on the ground, step my leg. I'm gonna come inside here with this knee, and I come through. The reason why I'm not coming in here nice and tight is because I'm hoping that I have the opportunity that from here, as I fall down, I have this leg to open up. Okay, where if I'm nice and tight here, I don't have that leverage. I really got to scoot back a lot to come in here and step back. Whichever way you feel comfortable doing it, you go ahead and do it, okay? But again, as I come here, I'm fast, but he's faster. He starts rolling. If I can control this, I will. And I stop him right here. I come through, I point this knee down, and I start putting that pressure for the calf crush. If he rolls all the way through, very important that I still stay here, I underhook this leg and I start going for the head, okay? One more time. Hold on a second, it's hot as hell here. Yeah, you're messed up too, man, right here. Thank you. Good. Thank you. Yeah, forget it, we're all one now, doesn't matter. All right, one more time. Okay. Don't judge me. <laughs> Don't you judge me. This is for you guys, not me. <clears throat> I swear. Boom, bam, whatever it is, comes in. Step, come through. As I'm stepping over, I'm falling back. Again, I want to try to go here. Perfect world, right? Alice in Wonderland. That's actually a messed up world, never mind. As I come in, he's faster than me. He's rolling through. If I can hold this, I will. I'm coming up, I'm bringing this knee down. Again, some people like to put this here. Your preference, but it can slip through and he's out of it right now. Okay, I'd have to flow into something else. Or I miss this, because he goes all the way through. I underhook, come in, and put that pressure. Okay? Uh, guys, thanks for watching. Please don't judge me.